So I chose urogynecology as a career um, because I found that helping women sort of cope with these um, issues that can really affect their quality of life was a very rewarding field to go into. We can sort of help women deal with these issues that they've often neglected for a while because they're busy taking care of other people, caring for children, um, and we can really improve someone's quality of life with what we do. The focus here is really on taking care of the patient in front of you and what's best for your patient. Um, and I found that there's great colleagues to sort of collaborate with to make sure that you're getting the best care for every patient. I really enjoy hiking um, and in med school my friends and I started doing some mountain climbing. Um, so we climbed Mount Washington in the winter and then we climbed Mount Rainier and then we hiked out to Everest Base Camp and hopefully sort of we're able to get to do some more hiking soon. I think my patients would say that I, I try and spend a long time with them and help them sort of sort out what's the best option for them. For the conditions I treat, we often have sort of a variety of, of treatment options ranging from sort of fairly conservative to much more aggressive and so I try and work with each patient to see what fits best for them and what's the best treatment for each patient. I really enjoy just treating a wide range of um, the urogyne field, focusing really on urinary incontinence and prolapse. It's something that so many women have and deal with and often they come to me and say I didn't even know this was a field, I didn't know there were any treatment options um, and then often after we've begun treatment or um, done surgery to fix their condition, the most common thing I hear is I can't believe I waited so long to do this.